I'm Arvid Weimann and I'm working as a head of general surgery department at the Klinikum St. George in Leipzig. For the next few minutes, I would like to discuss with you some problems of surgery which are related to a risk accumulation, cancer, comorbidity, age and nutritional status. And what we can do from a surgical metabolic point of view is just to perform a screening of the patients on admission with regard to the nutritional status. What does it mean? Look for weight loss, look for food intake in the week prior surgery and think about appropriate approaches with regard to the time before surgery. And what can we do? We can restore some deficits by appropriate nutrition, by, for example, by oral nutritional supplements in the days before surgery. We can perform metabolic conditioning by a glucose drink and we can perform what we call immunonutrition. And these approaches are appropriate with regard to optimal preparation for the patient before surgery and uh, after surgery. We have to look for the patient again and we have to perform and to continue nutritional support again. It is related to whether the patient can be fed via the enteral route. If it's not possible, we have to go for parenteral nutrition. But nowadays, in most cases, it's possible to give them oral and enteral food. But my approach, my focus is just look for the patient from a surgical point of view and from a metabolic point of view. And this is what not always is done in our real daily life.